Hello students, welcome to Akash. I am Umesh Oila, your career counselling expert here at Akash. In this video, we are going to discuss about the counselling process for Kerala state and a unique tool to predict your AIR and the possible colleges you may be eligible for. Okay, now look, in this video, we are going to discuss about some important points for the counselling of Kerala state and the points are seat matrix, cutoff analysis and the counselling process. Okay, official website is given here. Please have a look on it. If we are going to talk about the Kerala MBBS seat matrix, that how many MBBS colleges are present in Kerala state, then there are 34 colleges with the seat capacity of 4,905 and 12 in which are government medical colleges with the seat capacity of 1,755 and remaining 22 are the private medical colleges with a seat capacity of 3150. A map is shown on your screen. Please take a screenshot for the future reference. Here, a college list visible on your screen in which the college name, college type and the intake is given. You can check the college locality also here. The list for the private MBBS colleges. Noted? Okay. The second list of private MBBS colleges. Okay. Moving on the BDS seat matrix, the Kerala has 27 dental colleges with a seat capacity of 2020 in which 6 are government dental colleges with a seat capacity of 300 and remaining 21 are the private dental colleges with a seat capacity of 1720. Got it guys? Now let's have a look on the list of colleges and the private BDS colleges. The second list of private BDS colleges. Got it? Okay. Now, the Kerala State Medical Counseling, that how many reservations are present in Kerala State Counseling? So, let's have a look. The Government Medical Colleges, state quota 85%, means in all the state GMCs. Basically, there are four types of institutions and the four types of colleges are present in any state. The Central Government Medical Colleges, the State Government Medical Colleges, the deemed Universities and the State Private Medical Colleges and the Counseling Force Ames, Jipmer and all the Central Universities and the deemed Universities will be conducted by MCC only but the Counseling for the State Government Medical Colleges and the State Private Medical Colleges will be conducted by the State Specific Medical Authority. Got it guys? Then 85% seats means the counseling for these 85% seats will be conducted by Kerala State Medical Counseling Authority. Then where are the remaining 15% seats? Then these remaining 15% seats are under AIQ whose counseling will be conducted by MCC. Got it? And in the private medical colleges, the 100% seats and their counseling will be conducted by the Kerala State Medical Counseling Authority. Got it guys? And these 85% seats are reserved for the local student of Kerala only. Means no any outsider can take admission under these seats. For an example, I am from Delhi. If I want to take admission in the government medical colleges of Kerala, then I have only one option which is through the MCC counselling. Okay? Got it? Means these seats are reserved for you guys and these 100% seats are open for the local students as well as non-local students. Let's have a look on reservation. In the government medical colleges, the state merit quota means the open seats are the 50%, EWS 10%, SEBC 30%, SC and ST 10% and in SEBC quota, in SEBC quota for those 30% seats are reserved. Means these SEBC 30% seats are distributed as follows. Got it guys? Now, in the private medical colleges, community quota maximum 50%, 15% seats are reserved for the NRI only and 15% seats are all India quota and the state quota, all the remaining seats are under the state quota. Got it? Now, the government MBBS college cutoff 2024 means these are the highest cutoff. These are the highest cutoff on which 2024 admission take place. Okay, means these cutoffs give you a roughly idea where your 225 AIR might lie. Means you are in government college bracket or you are in private college bracket. Then the refined cutoff is provided on your screen for the specific category, for the specific quota. Got it? Now, please have a look on the private MBBS college cutoff for the 2024 and please take screenshot of both the section, the government college cutoff and the private medical college cutoff because this will be helpful in your choice filling section. Noted? Now, let's talk about the process. 
विच फॉलोज टू कंप्लीट द काउंसलिंग प्रोसेस ऑफ केरला स्टेट स्टेप वन द ऑनलाइन रजिस्ट्रेशन यू हैव टू कंप्लीट योर ऑनलाइन रजिस्ट्रेशन ऑन द गिवन वेबसाइट स्टेप टू द पब्लिकेशन ऑफ स्टेट रैंक मीन्स ए स्टेट रैंक लिस्ट विल बी पब्लिश एंड यू हैव टू चेक योर नेम इफ इट्स देयर देन यू हैव टू कंप्लीट योर ऑनलाइन चॉइस फिलिंग फॉर द राउंड वन एंड आफ्टर योर चॉइस फिलिंग अगेन ए लिस्ट विल बी पब्लिश विच नेम्स एज द अलॉटमेंट लिस्ट ओके यू हैव टू चेक योर नेम देयर ऑल्सो इफ इट्स देयर मीन्स you will be allotted by a college then you have to report at the allotted college with your tuition fee with your original documents and bonds if applicable then eligibility at first have a look on this the open state what are the open state means if any outsider student can take admission in the private college under the management quota then this state is open but if any outsider student is not allowed to take admission in private colleges as well then the state is closed for an example that punjab the gujarat is a closed state okay now let's discuss on eligibility for the seat reserved for the localites of kerala means the 85% seats in gmcs and the state quota in private medical college okay if you want to claim these seats and quota then you have to complete your eligibility then you have to provide your eligibility proof and what is the proof and what is the documents required the candidate must have the domicile certificate of kerala or the candidate must have passed 8 to 12th class from kerala or the candidate must have been a residence of kerala for a period of 5 years within the period of 12 years of his or her study got it guys now which documents are required at the time of counseling or at the time of allotment your academic eligibility mark sheet means your 10th and your 12th mark sheet the neat uz admit card and mark sheet domicile certificate if applicable category certificate if applicable pwd certificate if applicable passport size photograph you need 8 to 10 photograph here government id proof for an example your aadhar card your voter id card your dl which will be issued by any government and the certificate to prove dov means your uh, for an example your 10th mark sheet your aadhar card your birth certificate as well okay now then there is a post matrix scholarship scheme available the first one is keam bpl scholarship for the bpl category student and srk pratiksha trust scholarship for the meritorious and the economically backward mbba student from the kerala approx up to 60000 per annum to know more about the scholarship please visit on the given website which bonds are applicable in kerala then the discontinuation bond is applicable in kerala then what is the discontinuation bond after the allotment of seat if you withdraw your admission after the batch announcement for the mbbs first year then you have to pay a penalty amount which is known as the discontinuation bond the and this discontinuation bond is applicable in both government as well as the private medical colleges and for the kerala state and for mbbs course this is 10 lakh and for the bds course this is 5 lakh okay there is no any service bond applicable in kerala and about the tool which we talked about this is the akash neet rank and college predictor which link is provided in the description box also thank you so much and all the best for your future journey